Welp, we did it. Somehow got Luke and Sarah out of there. Uh, uh, okay. Look, I hate to ask this, but are we there yet? <laughs> We're not far. Look, Sarah, you can get through this. We both will. But I'm not okay. Just try. Can you do that? She just needs a little time, Clem. Leave her be for a bit. Leave. I don't know about this. The way she is, she's gonna cause problems. What happened in there? When we went in there, you were ready to help, but then something changed. Look, I just... I'd seen that kind of thing before. I just didn't want to stick around for the bitter end. Sorry, I... I don't mean to sound harsh. It's just the way things are. Does that mean you'd turn on me if I was hurt or something? No. I mean... Clem... I wouldn't have to. And just because you got her out of there today, doesn't mean you saved her. Trust me. I tried to save Jamie too, but she gave up. I just... I can't believe it. As soon as you guys said go, I was the first one up on the roof. Like I had already made up my mind. Luke. You can't let it eat away at you. Well, I can't forget it. I dragged my sister across four states. And every morning, she'd say she wasn't getting up. So I'd convince her. Or push her. Or goddamn carry her if I had to. Until this time... Walkers cornered us. Forced us up to the roof. And, and when they kept coming, I... I couldn't make her jump. Couldn't throw her. So I tried something else. I told her she could have what she wanted. And I left her there. Jumped to the next building over by myself. You left your sister? Jane, I'm really sorry. Really? It killed me for a long time. But I finally realized that I'd put her on a forced march finally. through hell. Finally. And all she really wanted was for me to let her go. Really? Sarah was that way too. Jane? No regard for her own safety. Or ours. Sarah and Jamie aren't the same person. We don't know if she'll end up like that. People don't change. Come on. Let's get back to your friends. Son of a bitch. You found him? Yeah, I'm a little amazed myself, to tell you the truth. If it weren't for Clem and Jane, well, I don't know what would have happened. Sarah, how you doing, hon? That's okay, sweetie. Whenever you're ready, I'm just glad you're here. Wait, wait. Where's Nick? <sighs> uh, Rebecca, how about we, uh, we go for a walk for a minute? Let's just give him some space. I have something I need to talk to you about, too. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> I ain't gonna sugarcoat this. That baby's coming even faster than Rebecca's letting on. But I was hoping you might know, does Luke know anything about babies? Has he, I don't know, mentioned Carlos teaching him anything? Just in case? Kenny had a family. He could help. Family. Where is he?
He went in there after you left. Said he needed a minute by himself. I ain't seen him since. I don't think he's doing well. I've seen him like this before. That's why I was thinking you could talk to him. I think if it's just you, someone he knows well, you might be able to get through to him. And I wouldn't ask you to do it if it weren't for the baby. <sighs> This group is falling apart. Let's see if we can repair it. I wanted to check on you. Make sure you're okay. It was like I was floating away, watching the whole thing happen to me. And then I woke up again, and nothing's changed. I'm still taking a beating. Every day. Duck. Katya. Sarita. No peace. No rest. The punches just keep coming. Why the hell couldn't Carver have just finished me off? Obviously, I ain't helping Obviously. anyone by being here. That's not true. You help me all the time. I need you. Hmm. I've seen you take care of yourself more than any three adults put together. But, uh, thanks for saying that. Nah, don't worry yourself about this. It's nothing. Hadn't killed me yet, anyway. It looks like it must hurt. Well? Oh, shit. Does that mean what I think it does? What are we supposed to do? We should see what's going on. Are you okay? How does it feel? It feels wet. That's how it feels. What's going on? Rebecca's water broke. Uh-oh. Oh, Christ. We should... I don't know what we should do. Oh, fuck. That means the baby's coming, right? Kenny, thank God. I think the baby's coming. What do we do? All right, all right. Give me a second. No way can Rebecca trap her like this. He's right. She's gonna make a lot of noise. They'll be able to smell her, too. Now you got no choice but to lock down and ride it out. It hurts more than before. Is something wrong? What kind of stuff do babies need when they're being born? If only I'd LP baby birthing mama. Kenny, come on, you gotta focus. Right, right, sorry. Clean water for one thing, and blankets. And we gotta get out of this damn cold, too. That map shows a couple of buildings nearby. Maybe one of them could do the trick. The museum seems like it could be a good start. I'll go. Good idea. Mike, think you could go with her? Sure thing. I'll check the building by the river. Okay, then. Kenny, you, uh, you stick with Rebecca, and I will check the perimeter for walkers. Sarah? Sarah? Just stay here with Rebecca and Kenny, okay? Clem... I know it must have been hard, but thank you for talking to Kenny. I'd love for you to give me and Mike a hand looking at the museum, but I was thinking... How do we know Jane ain't just gonna take off? Maybe you should go with her. Make sure she comes back. What do you mean by that? You know, she doesn't seem to like being around people much. And she volunteered to head off awful fast. I guess it could be nothing. She's helped us so far. 
Yeah, no, you're right. Maybe it's nothing. Just something to think about. Okay, we're looking for warm blankets, clean water, disinfectant. That all sound right? Don't worry. Everything's gonna be fine. Maybe I should go with Jane. Better hurry and catch up, then. All right, everyone, you know what to do. Let's be fast, and let's be careful. Okay, then. Let's get the things we need to make a baby. Well, not make a baby. To... I don't know. You know what I'm trying to say. Uh, whatever. Where the heck did Jane go anyway? Just gonna walk over here then, I guess. Oh, hey. Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah. Just a lot's happened today. And I don't know if... Well, it's sometimes good to have someone watching your back. So, come on, partner. Partner? Let's go check Aww. out that deck. I like the height. We're buddy buds. Partner? Partner? Don't let it get to your head. Let's go. But it made me so happy. I like being buddy buds. I hope this place is what we're looking for. God knows we could use a break. Check this out. This gate's still locked. Which means that hopefully no one's gotten to whatever was locked in hopefully. there. Hopefully. The Who knows what could be in there? That could be a place for Rebecca to have the baby. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Hmm, maybe I can pick the lock. A nail file? Versatility is not overrated. You know, uh, it wouldn't hurt to try a heavier hand at this thing. See if you can find something bigger. We might need to bust the mechanism. Alright, then let's see. Ooh, we could shove this cannon into the wall. You think this thing still works? <laughs> Check the muzzle, Napoleon. <laughs> nah. They fill them with cement so they're safe. <laughs> would have been really weird if something just popped out. Alright then, we got ourselves a telescope. Hello? There's some buildings across the river. I think I can see a church. The nearest river crossing is miles up. Rebecca wouldn't make it in her condition. Hello. Keep it in mind, though. Jane, there's someone coming toward us. coming this way and who knows if he has friends nearby should we run for it normally I would but it's too much normally. of a risk we can't lead him to the others lead. we should scope him out and see what he's up to I don't like having some stranger sneaking around so close to the others we've got enough on our plates with a baby coming last thing we need is someone telling their friends about the new easy targets in the neighborhood maybe I can try talking to him Good call. Shit. Hide now. Meow. What's he doing? Hey. Hello. I'm just a kid. Please, don't hurt me. Please. <laughs> Who 
Who are you? I am Arvo. I'm going to go. I don't want to shoot. I don't want to shoot anyone. Especially <coughs> маленькая девочка. Uh, a little girl. You don't have to shoot anyone. Just put the gun down. <gasps> Back up. Put the bag down. Clem, make sure he doesn't have any other weapons in there. Okay. No, I have no more Whoa. guns. I swear to we you. We just need to make sure you're not a threat. This you're is better real. than Girl Clementine, Scout cookies. Hurry. Please. Anything? Whoa. That's a serious stash of meds. No, 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 no. Take whatever you want, but don't take the medicine. It's for my sister. My older sister, she's sick. The pain makes her cry, and that makes those things come. Please. This Please. medicine is all she has. If that medicine's for your sister, why are you hiding it in the garbage? I, uh, I need to keep it, I need to keep it safe. Sister or not, we could really use that stuff. No, really? You are not nice people. Aww. You already left me defenseless, and now you, you take my sister's medicine? You are worried. Hey, Ibadite. we've got people who are suffering, who need this medicine. Luke's still a wreck after Carver's. Kenny's a mess. Rebecca's in pain. Look at all of it. Clementine, we need People that stuff. People are suffering just as much as yours. You are not special. Clementine, yes, you must believe We don't believe, believe a fucking believe. word about your sister. Please don't make my sister suffer. She has been through enough. Oh, yeah? Well, I think Clementine you just knows better joking. than anyone you what happens what that when word you means? steal huh? in this no, kind of I'm, world. I'm telling the truth. I swear upon my own life. I don't believe any of this. Medicine. Clementine. No, 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 no. You cannot take those from me. We're not taking this. You're not taking them. I'm not robbing anybody. Just let him go. Oh, Portia. Thank you, Clementine. Thank you. <laughs> oh, what are you doing? You don't have to do this. Just let me go. Jane, what are you doing? Don't you ever come around here again. I don't care if you do have some sick sister. The next time I see you, you won't just be walking away. Go. We're not letting Clementine go through an experience like that ever again. I can't believe I've gotten into this mess. Threatening some stupid kid? I thought you were gonna shoot him. Why? Did you want me to? No, I didn't. Go get the others. I'm gonna get this place opened. Then we need to get moved in ASAP. Hey, any luck with that observation, Dick? I was just checking on Rebecca and Kenny. They said they hadn't heard from me in a while. I don't guess there'd be much, but Jane seems pretty resourceful. God knows we could use a break. Jane and I were trying to open the gift shop, and a stranger showed up. What? Shit. This is the last thing we need right now. What happened? Jane took his gun and scared him off. Well, I, uh, I'm glad you're okay. Is Jane still up there now? Yeah, she's trying to get the gift shop opened. You know, I can't figure her out. I mean, she really lays it on the line, but really? at the same time, she doesn't show you anything that counts. 
I'm never quite sure if she just done like people, or just plain out done like me. I'm still not sure what to think about her. She's strong, and she's been helping us, but she's cold. Maybe. Nobody's that cold. I'm definitely starting to think we might need to branch definitely. out. Definitely. What do you mean? Jane seems like the kind of person who gets tempered by hardship, you know? But when I look at Kenny now, he just, he seems broken. And broken people get reckless. I know you got a history with him. Look, I think he's a good guy. At least started as a good guy. Beast. But I just think he's had to take more than he can handle. You're wrong. Kenny's stronger than anyone. He tries to protect us. I don't know, Clem. I know he's your friend and all. But what Kenny did to Carver, it sounded like he beat right through the corpse and into the floor. Is that where we are now? What would you have done if it was you? Well, I don't know. Really, I don't. I just think less. Really? I need to tell the others about the deck. Yeah, good. I will, uh, I'll see you back there. I'll say it again. Kenny's not perfect, but I definitely don't think he's as bad as everyone says he is. Yeah, he's really broken right now, but he has good reason to be. But we could recover from it, I think.